Alright, what's up guys? It's Alex AJG094 and uh, today is a little vid on a program I like. Um, saves you time when launching programs. It's uh, it's called a launchy. And uh, launchy is pretty tight. What the basis of it is uh, you press the combination of keys and you get a little panel that'll pop up. You type what program you want, press enter, you got it. And here's a little demo of it. And uh, my key, my key combination of keys is control shift space. I'll press those, control shift space, bam, panel. Uh, so so you wanted to program, so I go into like start menu icon, just like be calculator, calculator, boom, there. You know, it's uh, really fast. And uh, instead of going to like start program menus or uh, so you did this, uh, I don't have desktop icons shown. Like say you're using these icons, I hate going through icons and shit like that, so I don't do it. But um, yeah, so it's uh, a lot faster than going to start menu and everything. All right, so uh, let's uh, show you how to get it. If you open up a web browser, of course, uh, all you need to do is go, go to Launchy. Just type in Launchy right there. Launchy, the open source keystrokes launcher. Oh yeah, it's open source. I forgot about that. And uh, the ma I figured this about uh, out about this program um, just a little little bit ago. Oh look, it's even for Ubuntu. Um, and the reason I wanted it is because uh, I had it for Ubuntu. Of course, you go here and you save it. I'm not gonna save it right now, but once you get it, just run the exe, install it, and everything. And uh, there you go. And but I got it. I first saw it on Ubuntu or the feature on Ubuntu. It was um, it was a docky or whatever. But I didn't have it for Windows and dockies are for Windows. But this is what it is. All right. So all right here we got general. Um, you got all your options you want right here. You can set your keys, your fade out time, everything like that. Skins. Uh, we got some skins here. You got no. I don't really like that. Quicksilver two is pretty high. Spotlight wide, Mercury, default, black glass. I think I got mine on Mercury. Yeah, I got my Mercury. Yeah, Mercury. And uh, when you first get it, you're going to have to, uh, yeah, it'll, you can also you uh, set it to what you want, like uh, where you can launch from, like the start menu or anything, or the quick launch. Um, quick launch is also really helpful because uh, I used to run quick launch. But, uh, yeah, when you first get it, though, you're going to want to rebuild catalog. And when you rebuild the catalog, it basically goes through all those folders and files and everything and goes, oh, these are EXEs that can be run. So you can find everything and like, you can use it to go to your documents. All right, right there. You can use it to go to your uh, computer real quick. You know, it's just that. It's just that quick, man. It's just that quick. It's wild. I love it. I love launch. It's pretty sick. Uh, just, on a scale of one to ten, I give this an eight because it's not super, super crazy amazing. Uh, oh, real quick, check this out. It's also pretty cool. Go to the task manager, processes. Let's look at launchy. Where's Launchy? Damn it, where's Launchy? Oh, right here, Launchy.exe. Look, only takes 10 megabytes of memory, guys. So it's not going to your, slow your program like some of those other cool launchers or whatever. Like, I used to run docs, but I don't run them anymore. Uh, but, like, say you had a doc, it takes up a lot of resources compared to Launchy. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty sick. Um, I like it a lot. So, uh, check it out, guys. Um, if you didn't see the part or whatever, I guess I'll put a link in the underbar or whatever the fuck you want to call that so uh yeah check it out uh and i'll see you guys later